Once you're all dead, I'll deliver the Storm Corps to the agency and settle accounts. They are incredibly excited to finally receive delivery of their new toy. Your toy is going nowhere, Espinosa. Hmm. The core finished charging a minute or two before you cut the power. It's launching as we speak. Say hello to your father for me, Rico. Take us down. Rico! It's launching! He's going to kill everyone on this mountain. Plugging you to the flight controller, Mira. Hurry! We're locked out. We can't stop this storm. What is your plan, Rodriguez? Gabriela? I'm open to suggestions. Stand by. We're in. I disabled the firewall. I will not sacrifice the lives of my soldiers for that man's pride. But can you stop this storm? Only Espinosa can stop it. Give Rodriguez the flight controls. And he can steer the storm for us to see. I have a better idea. Told you I'd find you, Oscar. Rodriguez? That nicety is commendable. Did my father ever tell you the Rodriguez family motto? It's not something we ever really discussed. Don't fuck with a scorpion, unless you're prepared to be stung. Wait. Wait, 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 we can make a deal! I mean, you can see why I thought it was aliens. It was a flying saucer, see or not? If I told you about the things we didn't finish... Wait, what? Ay, dígame, dígame. Izzy, get over here. You have to try this. Hey, I'm a vegetarian. But it's real American barbecue. Oh, no, no, son. This isn't real American barbecue. This, this is grilling. Now, the only real barbecue comes from Central Texas. <laughs> Just like me. Don't fuck with the scorpion. Something Espinosa said. My father and I have always been pawns in a larger game. No. You think that's true? He was. Maybe not in Solis. Well, definitely not in Solis. Destroying Project Yapa must have cost the agency trillions. It always comes back to the agency. That it does. Let's take them down. <laughs> Let's take down the agency. Son of a bitch. All right. I'm in. I'm with you too, Rico. We're with you. We 
have an army. It's not a bad start. Come on. We'll tell the others in the morning. <laughs> Messy, but yeah, that was messy. But I am glad. <laughs> okay. To be fair, the only thing that really got chopped up, chopped and screwed, was the uh, that one cutscene with uh, Espinosa, which. Uh, out of all possible things get messed up at not you know what that's not the best but that's fine well not fine I mean I'm still upset that the stream just dropped again and that there's no way for me to pause the cutscene because if I you know, try to press pause or anything it would just skip it but <laughs> Uh, in the end, I can try linking to that cutscene or something. Someone must have un like uploaded that cutscene in full, which is a shame. That's not just part of the LP, but oh, and also I'll probably have to combine the pieces of this LP into uh, thing. Or I don't know. I'll figure something out. <sighs> but yeah, I'm now. I don't send this credit scene. There's still a bit more that I have to do for this uh, LP, but might as well talk about my thoughts on this game. Like, you now I think it's pretty obvious that it's fun. It's a blast to play. It's a bit, a bit. It feels more than a bit, but uh, for now, let's just say a bit confused about politics or not. Maybe. I mean, like you do take down this like corrupt like um, holograph. All your, all your, ah. <laughs> I'm forgetting how to pronounce uh, all group. Ah. You know what I mean. Like, uh, this dictator, you know, CEO, you know, whose family has been in power for 500 years on this island. Ah. Oligarchy. That's the term. Ol like, yeah, you know, because it's just everything was his own world. Like, the Black Hand was his personal private military contractors. Like, like the country doesn't even have a nationalized army, just the private military contractors of the president. Who basically had free will to do whatever they want. But, and, you know, I still, you know, I'll still <laughs> complain about, like, not having you know, ways to, like, offset, like, friendly fire, especially on the civilians in this, you know, up, like, this uprising against, uh, this uncaring dictator, and you can just still accidentally blow up civilians willy-nilly, and, like, I don't know, like, I feel like something should happen with that, or, like, they should give you some means to deflect from, not deflect, but, uh, to, uh, to, like, try to help you not do that, like highlighting, like, I don't know, an option to highlight enemies, or maybe something that you can unlock that can show, like, oh, hey, enemies are highlighted like this, friendlies are high, you know, in, like, red, like, friendlies are highlighted in blue. Like, when they're on the low health, enemies get highlighted in red. And the, most of the screen goes to monotone to help you, like, know where to run, run away towards, or run away from so, like, I feel like they could have done that. But, yeah, no, it, um... <laughs> talking about, you know, the gameplay and stuff, but... Overall, it was fun, you know, like... Uh, God, I'm just... I still remember the first time I ever heard... The Army of Chaos. Of just, like, okay... 
I, I know the Just Cause series has all been has always been about chaos, but just like uh, what's the the name of this resistance group? Army of Chaos. I'm like, all right, <laughs> all right, <laughs> sure. And yeah, now oh, and also like I. Uh, I oh, yeah, you may have noted like some people peeps may have noticed that like while I upgrade upgrade upload some uh extra videos to my YouTube channel and whatnot, especially showing like weird glitches or whatnot. Like another thing I should say about this game is that like I got this knowing full well what kind of game it is and just like oh big open world games like this, you know, kind of tend to be a bit buggy, just because there's so much. Like, you know, like, I don't think any big open world game is kind of free of that. And I know when this game first came out, it was just riddled with bugs, and like, like, oh, like if you go to the reviews on, like, Xbox or probably other websites, like, you'll probably see the, like, years old, like, back in 2008, or not, 2008, 2018, you know, reviews talking about, like, the bugs and glitches and whatnot. And, you know, like, I got this, like, I think 2019? 2020? I keep forgetting when exactly, but, like, yeah, like, I think, like, after, you know, the bug fixes, <laughs> the bug fixes, and, you know, the the DLC and whatnot, I think this is honestly a really fun experience. If you're, if you're looking for an action movie in a video game, that's also a sandbox, then like, yeah, go for it. Cause there's so much that you can just mess around with and just, yeah, I don't know. I'm just kind of rambling at this point, partially afraid of the, the, uh, the stream dying again. Uh, <laughs> I'm suffering. I'm dying Squirtle. Uh. <laughs> I'm just also thinking of that uh, one meme, you know, of George Casanza in uh, Seinfeld in the hospital bed. You know, where like last year people would be like, it, it, you know, just caption it with like, it, it was supposed to be the year, <laughs> the year 2020 vision. Or like, but I'm just thinking about that of like, this is supposed to be the 420 stream. <laughs> Cause just cause the twenty, you know, the just cause for twentieth stream. I was like, hey, that's fun, and then everything went to hell. And I think, I think that might have been my problem. If if you know, you're you're humor, <laughs> you know, if you uh, can humor me being superstitious for a moment, I think that was my problem of trying to make a joke about four twenty and then not being able to come up with a snappy subtitle for this stream. Before I began, I think that's where my downfall is, obviously. Totally. <sighs> but. Yeah. Fun game. I kind of wish that there was more of a boss battle towards the end. Like, I, I pr it was fun just you know, blasting the, the helicopters and whatnot. But I kind of wish it was, like, a bit more intense, which. Then again, I kind of see why the DLC were the way they were. You know, the first one, uh, Daredevils of Destruction, like that one. You know, well, the completely different experience. It focused more on the cars and making you know players actually use them more, especially the the gang cars with all their weird weapons and like special abilities. That was great. It was very much what I thought it would be of... Oh, it was more than I thought it would be. I thought it would just be, like, Mad Max meets Need for Speed, which it was, but it was very much also its own weird Just Cause 4 thing. Especially since none of none of the, the car challenges were really, like, races, per se. Like, you had to get to the, uh, the, the uh, checkpoints, you know, to get additional time. Like, you know, you only had, like, a, you had a time limit for that, but, like, it wasn't really a race. You never had to really beat the first person in, uh, you know, like, you never had to be first in any of those races. It's just kind of, 
like it could easily happen like there's a lot of those where i think i was like up front at first but like yeah it was it was its own weird thing and i appreciate that uh then you know los demonios that was that was sick as hell that was slick like it it continued the just cause for like especially with the army of chaos like obsession with like neon colors <laughs> and I'm, I'm dumped back here that's funny um but let's do this real quick but yeah, you know, um, Los Demonios, like, it was its own weird thing, but that one really had challenges that felt more like boss battles, of just, like, how intense everything was. And... Hell yeah. Hell yes. And, uh, while I'm looking at things... Because there's still, like, this isn't, you know, towards, uh, this is getting closer to the end where the stream usually would end, but there's still one thing we absolutely have to do. Hopefully the game won't oddly freeze up. It's this. Finishing the third DLC. Daredevil's, uh, not Daredevil. Danger Rising. Uh, I know, like, let me get a drink of water real quick before continuing on with my thoughts about this game. <clears throat> ah. Well, control the blizzard. Return to Yapa in the, uh, gotchas re- Ah, uh, got- gotchas? Gotchas? Gotchas. Gotchas? Ah, oh, I'm mispronouncing this left and right. Uh, return to Ayapa in the Gatches region to activate the Blizzard Core on demand. Use AR scan and follow the waypoint to the console. Uh, activate or deactivate the Blizzard with the press of a button. Interesting. Thanks for flying with the Army of Chaos. Ah, oh, now that's one thing I should talk about. I never, I never really understood why you'd want to re, you know, like, reactivate the 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 weather machines because you can't really like the game never really like, gives you an option to like redirect them or move them around like like there's the tornadoes that like you can bring that back they just have a perpetual like tornado in a place but you can never like actually control it or move it around like if you could like reactivate it and then send it at like a uh, a base belonging to the Black Hand like that would have been dope as hell but you can't I th well technically you can't I was distracted for a second and crashed into the ground that, that feels about right but yeah um, technically you can if you use the wind can or like the wind cannons but like that that takes a lot of work <laughs> And there's like the lightning storm that you just turn on and the one place gets the lightning storm again. So it's just weird. Alright. Alright, stream still going. Oh, so an all sniper. Rock up. All right, before things go to hell, let's start this up. But yeah, I yeah the DLCs are good, are great, especially since like it's hard to do boss battle in games like this without it feeling a bit weird. Like I know Just Cause Two had boss battles, and those were kind of a bit odd, <laughs> but I think like how Los Demonios and like. The submarines here, like, where no it's basically a whole level as a, a big challenge, like, that really works for, like, Rico a new and, like, what he's about. Back. Got a visual on his flagship. Rodriguez method work. Always does. 
Here. Still no idea what his primary objective is, but looks like Miller's packing up to head home. We need to sink that sub. And you need Miller's briefcase. Only way you'll be able to deactivate that tracker. I'll get Miller. This is the last time the agency comes after me. Miller will make a break for it as soon as he spots you. Work fast, Rico. All right. And in case you missed um, how this started out, endangerizing. Intel. Like the USS Statesman, Miller's command ship. Defenses. Miller hasn't set up any infrastructure, so all the subs raw firepower. Personnel. A metric shit ton of agents. Alright. Before it continues, I feel like I should give a refresher in case anyone is <laughs> watching this without having seen the uh, other Dangerizing stuff, but um, Tom Sheldon notices like the like uh, signal from the agency and from that, like, we're able to steal the hoverboard that we can now use, but also they tracked Rico due to his grappler, which was like a prototype. And, you know, he's not going to give that up. So instead, we're, like, trying to uh, get to this briefcase to turn off, or, you know, I not turn off, but to disable the tracker. Why'd she tip us off about Miller? We're not going to start giving people shit for betraying the agency, are we? Hmm. But yeah, and we've also discovered that they had other goals and agendas while around the lease. Like, Rico isn't the main target, but, like, obviously. Hey, Rico. In a while. This means war. Emmy Miller. Sorry you had to scrub your mission. Keep thinking that. Need to borrow your briefcase. I don't think so. All oh, hey, Rodriguez is here. Kill him at all costs. costs. Gonna cost you a lot. He's dead. No, I have infinite ammo for this section. I just not noticed that. Keep going, kid. Tom Shelton. Was hoping you'd be here. They gave me your chair when they put you out to pasture. It smells like a humidor. <laughs> That's good. Your old chair smelled like an asshole. Always the class act, Tom.
on. All hands, we're losing power. Get systems back online. Who is only as good as our captain, Miller? Shut up, Rico. Ah, that works. Also, I'm missing something on this end. Oh, okay, that must be outside. To abandon ship, Miller. Shit. Oh, man, this is Miller. Prepare to abandon ship. <laughs> nice. Great. Two more. I know exactly where they are. Ah. <sighs> Destroy everything you touch. It's part of the job. He's making a break for it, Rico. Go get him. Man, we have an intruder on site. Acknowledge intruder on site. All units engage. We've lost the target. Stand down for now. <sighs> Just take off the grappling hook, Rico. Agency won't be able to track you. Ah, uh, who easy? Get fuck. You're persistent, definitely skilled. Thank you. Kind of stupid though. You think this is going to end here? Maybe not. But you end here. See. Okay. I think I know what I'm doing wrong.
Heads up, Rico. Looks like Miller's got another ship behind that island. I see it. He's not going anywhere. Ah, nuts. I can't just lock onto him. Or grapple onto him. You've got one last chance. Give me the case. Fuck you, Rico. Very obsessed with uh what? Oh, you think uh Where are you? You're getting too old for this. Barely breaking a sweat. Sometimes you gotta use the demon. Uh, sometimes you gotta run away. Uh, all right. No, it. You have a rail gun. I have a demon killing crossbow. Let's dance. Tried. It wasn't for me. You can't beat the agency, Rico. The agency is America. It's not some banana republic. You're not equipped for it. It's not the agency you should be worried about right now. Let's retreat a little bit. Just give up. Save us some time. I don't lose, Rico. Here it goes. All right. I was trying to do something slick, but obviously it didn't work. No! Get fucked. Oh. No, this is honestly working pretty well for a boss battle, especially since it's another agent. And, no, I think not tired. having a health bar not on your life, old helps. Man. Also, I'm out of ammo with my good gun. Miller's dead. Say a few words. He talked too much. <laughs> Got the case. <laughs> Getting rid of the tracker. Done. How's it feel to be a free man? Miller's right. It's not over. Yeah, well... It's over for today, kid. Report. 
Miller's dead. <sighs> Unfortunate. Miller was a good agent. I told you he was no match for Rico, but he fulfilled his role as a distraction. And what about Rodriguez? Killing Rico was a long shot. Miller was the only one who believed he could actually do it. The primary objective was a success. I was able to recover more than enough data to rebuild Project Iapa at a friendlier site. Excellent work, Agent Kane. Thank you, sir. What? Hoverboard course is a new challenge awaits you. Go back to the submarines and find it. What? I've... I had to be... You know what? I'll do the submarine... No, I may have enough time to do one of the submarine courses. But, yeah... I think I'm going... <laughs> no, I'll do one. Tightrope court. Uh, course, Rico may have sunk the USS Statement, but it uh, carcass makes it for a pretty sweet hoverboard course. No, yeah, we'll try one of them, but for the rest, I'm probably just going to record... Like, you know, I'll probably just uh, record them like I would the... Uh, the S rank challenge, uh, trying to get the Daredevil challenges S rank. Come on. <laughs> like, that works. Like, <laughs> yeah. There, yeah, there was a pretty good reason why I decided to do this one. Uh, finish this after finishing the main game, because, yeah, no, it very much implies that. Let's go. We could have something here. Looking into it. Oh, wait, what? Okay. Okay, I'm... I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna... Hmm. Okay, I think I know what... Complete in 30 seconds. Alright, I think I know what I'm supposed to do. Well, let the timer go up for trying again. Oh, yeah! Let's do this! Uh. All right. Hmm. Okay, I think I know what I want to do to have uh, you can do this. More speed to start off with. Chaos hoverboard. Not. I think I know where that is. Customize. Not. Did I unlock any new uh, patterns while I'm looking? Ah, uh, not yet. Soon. Ah, standard issue. Oh. This looks. Oh, I love this rainbow neon ass hoverboard. Hell yeah. Tight. Alright. Oh, I think I was supposed to do this the other way around, maybe. But it let me start at. No, I had. Well. 
Uh, Lost on Lonely Old Stanger Rising. Gale 4. Alright. And now to finish off the stream, I'll just keep doing some of these. Because, yeah, these are really short, actually. Ah, oh, no. Man, I got stuck on here. Ugh. Ah, hate it here. <laughs> ah, ah, happy to see you, Finn. But also, the game has basically been beaten, except now I've unlocked fun little hoverboard challenges. Which I say fun. Oh, they are fun. But it's just, come on. Not an expert. With this hoverboard yet. Well, I'm doing pretty good. And also, we beat the game as Rikau. And before that, uh, <laughs> Rocket tries to blow me up. Uh, standard board. The board we unlocked. Uh, this one, Agency. No, oh, that's honestly fairly nice. No, it, yeah, the orange is pretty nice. Not my favorite color, but yeah. I'll probably keep doing some more of these hoverboard stuff for a bit. Like, there shouldn't be that many, actually. Oh. Sure. A uh, skimboard on the Salino stand bar before continuing the course in, into the USS Conquest. Alright, yeah. Especially... Yeah, there's, like, only, like, what, seven... And there's only like seven of these, or something, maybe. I think there might be one that gets unlocked after you beat the others, but like, should be easy enough to do. I think that'd be a fun way to end the stream. But, yeah, I had... Spread your wings, Rico. Um... And drink some water, of course. But, yeah, um, Felice, 
is now free from Espinosa Control. We've for, uh, kind of forced the agency Let's go. out of uh, Seleno. Hell yeah. Black hand hoverboard. Let's not take cover behind the uh <laughs> the missiles. Uh customize. Black hand. And yeah, I decided to beat the game as Recal. And Cass beat me to uh, a joke about <laughs> celebrating <laughs> late trans day of visibility by uh, being the one trans cow, trans man cow from Barnyard. <laughs> Holy cow. Uh, but yeah. Mission complete. Uh, oh. Did I? I did that one. It doesn't have the fancy... Oh, that's under 15 seconds. No, I can do this one. No, it... Let me... I'm gonna... Be this one. I want the fancy star. I don't... Why settle for a cool star when you can have a star with a cool circle around it? Got you later, Rigo. Give him hell. Let's go. Nice. All right. Good enough for a fancy star. Gale course. Uh, wind cannons can be a help or a hindrance in this course that runs through the USS uh, White Feather. Gotcha. Uh, but oh yeah, and since you're here, <laughs> yeah, just earlier in the stream, like the stream just kind of died. Thanks for flying with the which army of chaos. Sucked. And then around one of the final main uh, cutscenes, or one of the end cutscenes, like the stream also died. It came back pretty quickly after, but eh, I think that final cutscene got kind of chopped up in pieces. But I mean, out of all the things that could go wrong, I think like <laughs> part of a cutscene being chopped off isn't the worst. I mean, I, I rather it wouldn't have been chopped off, but yeah, and go. Uh, uh, I'm suffering. Uh, okay, I'm not. I'm just gonna go back to the start of this. Yeah, I'm not. Come on, you can do this. Yeah, now that that wasn't gonna win. Here we go. Uh, is that good enough for the special star? Yeah, it is. Hell yeah. Nightlight. And let's show that off.
Oh, it's purple. Which, yeah, I love purple. 